today I am going to be doing a couple meal ideas. If you are new here, I am a wife and a mom to five kids. Um, on my channels, I like doing organizing, cleaning, deep cleaning, decorating. If you like these types of videos, please like and subscribe. And thanks for watching. I wish you felt the same, and I make this stupid like every day. Don't know what to do or what I should say, cause I. Once I come home from work, I usually try to take a little break, sit down and rest for a little bit until I have to get up and get the kitchen cleaned up and get the dishwasher going and get started on dinner. Here I was just filling up the dishwasher and getting that going and then I'm going to wash the dishes that I can't put in the dishwasher and then I have to start on dinner. I'm thinking about him How would he understand If I told him how I feel about him You told me more than once to show you my intention My brain gets blocked at times but now Somehow I'll give you my attention You've got to know that I I ain't a person who understands All the clockwork of our romance You make me feel so On. If you're gonna be moving on solo Wait a second cause they're playing the best song I'll be there if you reach out to me
decided to click on my video and watch it, could you please comment down below and tell me where you're from? I am from Missouri. It's been hot here. What's the weather been where you are at? If you reach out to me Now it's time to start on dinner. We are having tacos tonight for dinner. Does anybody else in their family like tacos? Comment down below, let me know. Not everyone in my family likes tacos. There's only a few of us that really like it, but sometimes I try to mix it up and do tacos or nachos. I know some of my kids like the nachos part, but they don't put the hamburger in with their nachos. So, I'm doing tacos tonight. It's kind of easy night. And I decided just to do tacos. Feel your hands The way you're touching me around my neck Got chills down my back You do it right The way you're holding me No, I don't want this moment to stop No need to fight it I cannot hide it Now I'm on my other dinner idea. This is like a family favorite. I'm adding three cans of green beans, two cans of cream and mushroom soup, and then the green beans in the pan. And here's the seasonings, onion powder, garlic powder, and onion flakes. Um, I put the dried onions 
the French's, French's dried onions on top. Cut up the chicken and cook that. And I'm having rice to go with it for dinner and some rolls. Cheers to all the memories, the venom and the remedies, yeah. Promise I won't forget. Now I'm adding the seasonings on top of the green beans before I put the cream and mushroom soup. Putting some salt and pepper. And then I put the garlic powder and the onion flakes and there's the onion flakes I just sprinkle a little bit of that stuff on you don't have to put that stuff on if you don't want to that's I just give that extra flavor that is my daughter there on the phone with her friend Once I get all of the seasonings on, then I usually mix all of that up in the green beans and stuff. And then I add the, the cream and mushroom soup on the top of the green beans and mix all of that together. Now I'm going to mix all of it up together and add my cream and mushroom soup. It's a little liquidy. I think I put too much milk in it, but I just did that to get the rest of the extra cream and mushroom soup out of the can. But it still turned out pretty good. See, I pour that on top, mix that around really good, get everything out of the bowl. Here I am going to mix it all together. Has anybody ever tried this before? I know Grimmy casserole is a good side dish for the holidays, but I tried it with chicken and my family liked it. So now we have this a lot, but I usually do it like towards the fall time or when it's getting kind of chilly outside. Because it seems to be like a fall type dish. But. It's starting to get. Fall time. Cooler weather. So I decided to make this. Here I'm going to be adding the chicken. I add the chicken in. <coughs> I don't put all of the chicken in. I save some out. But I add the chicken in and then I, I mix all of that together. Now here I am just mixing it all together and then I will be adding the dried onion flakes on top just like you do whenever you make green bean casserole. That's like kind of the best part of it. Gives it a crunchy crispy taste. Um, if anybody would like the recipe for this. It's just regular green bean casserole and then you just add the chicken. There's the dried onion flakes that I put on the top. And then you just bake it in the oven. Like 20 minutes or so. And here it is. I think I um, baked it a little too long 
because the dried onions got a little burnt, I think. But my kids still ate it, so here it is. It tastes pretty good with the chicken in it. I was just checking to make sure if it was warm or not. But here it is. And then I had the rice and the rolls to go with it. And we had a little bit left over for lunch the next day. But it all came out pretty good. Let me know if you try this recipe. Comment down below and let me know. And give me your opinion on it. If you like it with the chicken or if you f would prefer just the green bean casserole with the, the dried onions on top. Comment down below and let me know. And if you like watching these types of videos, please like and subscribe to my channel. Help me out. And thanks for watching. Bye!